All I see is blessings, got no time for stressing Don't believe in failures in my life, it's only lessons They just making room for what I'm on now I don't got a clue, but I know the one who does know how Oh wow, it's like I'm learning again Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, it is I, Miss Licious So in today's video, just guess what? I'm in Benin City and I decided to show you guys around Benin and based on the Oweido Pataki that I am so I'll be showing you guys the city so guys if you're new here welcome to the family please like share and subscribe if you haven't already and let's get down to the video so guys Benin City is the capital of Edo State Southern Nigeria all road leading to Bini City from the east, west, north or south terminated at Ring Road. Bini City is globally recognized as the center of art and culture. So right now guys, we are just at Airport Road leading to Ring Road. So guys, this is the famous Oba Palace fence from Airport Road. This is the entrance to Oba Palace. As you can see from the outside, the palace is really big. This is still the fence that I'm showing you guys and long. This is Ring Road, otherwise referred to as King Square or Oba Overa Men Square, is located in the heart of Edo State. Ring Road was the place where the Corona Master used to hold court. It was used as a center of recruiting soldiers. It is one of Benin City's biggest intersections with major roads such as Aquaquava, Airport Road, Sapley Road, Forestry. Old Sakumba and other streets running off the roundabouts. This is a statue of Obaisege who reigned in Bini Kingdom, who helped transform the kingdom into an empire. European connection with the kingdom became stronger during its reign as Portuguese missionary activities were encouraged in the kingdom. Ring Road is one of the busiest places in Benin City. This sculpture is one of the Benin chief. I really don't know his name, but I think he also fought for Benin Kingdom. I'm just trying to film around Ring Road. Believe me, guys, it's not easy. Everyone was staring at me like, what the hell is she doing? <laughs> this is the statue of Oba Overwame, was the last independent Oba to reign before Benin Kingdom fell to British forces during the Benin primitive expenditure of 1897. The kingdom was destroyed and looted of its many valuable artificials, and he was also dethroned and deported to Calabar. This is the statue of General Ebohemi. He is another Benin giant who fought to death during the British punitive expedition. It was said that he died while standing on his feet and his corpse was rooted up and brought down. Well, this sculpture, I don't know the meaning, I don't know why it's here at Ring Road, but I have nothing to say about this. So, moving on. But if you are from Benin and you know the meaning or the name of that sculpture, please let me know in the comment section.
this is a sculpture of Obagato and his chief. And also these sculptures are also located at Wingold but close to the Parliament's house. I can't talk about Wingold without mentioning the National Museum which is inside the roundabout. So I enter to check some of the artifacts. Believe me, I have to hide my phone because they won't allow you to use your phone to snap or anything. Maybe you can snap but you can't record. Next, I'm going to be heading to Igbo Street where creativity is guided. Home of Guide of Bini Bronzer Carter. One is assailed by popular Bini Brown's work of the king and queen and other notable royalty as well as other artistic morphids on display at various shops. The show which also displayed no bronze products such as wood carving and painting from part of the bungalow that make up the way cave street of Igun famous bronze making. Most houses on the street built on mud still stand tall and strong till today. You can't come to Ringwood without coming to the famous urban markets. This is one of the biggest markets in Bini City. Located close to the Oba Palace. So guys, I'm just going to show you guys around the market because I'm going to get some stuff to buy from the market. So just come along with me. Whatever you are looking for, you can get in this market, very affordable, clothes, food stuff, anything at all you can find in this market and the price are very reasonable. So next, I'm heading to where they sell jeans, all kinds of jeans, jeans skirts, jeans trousers bone shorts whatever jeans you're looking for yeah so i'm just here to do some thrift shopping so guys i hope you enjoyed this vlog if you're new to my channel welcome to the family subscribe like and share this video and i'm going to be seeing you guys on my next video